this is what happens with eight inches of rain. So here's the RV. You can see the angle. And to give you an idea how high all this is, this is what we're facing before we start. That, my friends, should worry you a little bit. Ginger seems very upset about this whole thing. This is this is her upset look. This is also her excited look. Retracting all. Well, the good news is, it didn't tip over. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Starting to slip. What slipped? It's starting to slide down this way. Driver's side here. Yeah. Come on! If you would like to know what I look like when I'm concerned, this would be the look. How are you holding up in there? <laughs> Just a big smile. You're faking it for the camera. Okay. Some time has passed. We've decided we're going to go forward and then try to go backward from there. We've put boards and wood and I'm going to try it again. I don't know. Cross fingers again. Dennis is now behind the wheel. Oh no! Battery's dead. Guess we won't be doing this right away. So one of the ideas would be to come forward like this. Unfortunately, that's where the septic tank used to be. And the vehicle is wide enough that it would go from here, where it would clip the gutter, all the way to right about here. And while we can move stuff, we're then going to put all that weight in an area that will sink. And that is not good. We've taken a break for, oh, I don't know, 20, 30 minutes. Sun's trying to come out. We're gonna see if we can roll it forward and then roll it back. New battery in here. Uh-oh. And the new battery's not working. So what was that part about house guests? Um, have you heard the one about the house guests who wouldn't go away? I have now. <laughs> well, when it stops raining, we might think about it. This is just like Branson, except, you know. Right. With lots of, lots of rain. <laughs> <laughs> 